So the question is about linking articles together. So we're going to go ahead and go to our article manager and open up an article. Let's go to our Kids Eat for Free on Sundays. So here's an article. And we do have a Read More button in here. Let's link this first bit of text to a different article. We can do that by clicking on the chain link icon within the JC editor here to create the link. Now you can add an uh, URL here if you want to link to an external resource or come to content if you want to link to an article within your site and um, open up the category where that article is saved. Let's go, let's say we're just going to link to restaurant reviews and I better make sure it's an active one. I know the reservations is active, so let's click this article. And then to get that, you know, what you're looking for, Eris, your question is about the target. You can select your target to open in a new window, in a parent window or frame, in a top frame. Jen, what are the differences between these targets? The first one is, is the current window within a frame. Uh, so that puts it basically like in an iframe or, or some sort of like web frame, which keeps the the navigation and stuff there. So that's one. The new window, that's probably the most common one. That will open it in a new tab on your computer next to. That's the one that you're looking for, the one that opens it next to your current site within a new tab. The open in the parent window, that's the same thing as open in the same window. It's the, the parent, the window that you're in right now. And what's the last one? Open in a top frame, I believe this is creating an entirely new um, browser. You'll open up a, like a new browser, right? A browser window. Right, yeah. with, with no tabs. It's funny that I think the word frame kind of throws you off. Do you remember back in the old days when web websites were built using frames? Mm -hmm. And the header was in one frame and the sidebar was in another frame. Yeah, so I think that's kind of where that terminology comes from, even though it's not necessarily used as much anymore. Okay. I'm going to, now you think this is the, for the pop-up? Uh, no, that's the current window, so it's the next one down. Open in a new window. But this won't pop it up in a smaller window. This will have it just a new tab. Right. Oh, does she want it in a... She wants it in a pop-up. Oh, in a pop-up. Um, yeah, you can try, say, current window. So let's click insert to see what this looks like. So we should have created our link. Let's go and save. And then we're going to go to that menu item. That's going to be under our blog. And actually, you know what? I need to log in to access our blog because we've set this to a specific user group only. So I need to, oops. I remember. I remember. We should uh, we should change that because I I played around so much with the user settings to create that 404 error. Now I'm just confusing oh, everybody. See. Yeah. Um, let's go back. And so here's the. This was in this category. We changed it. So let's open this up. Let's see how this link works. So this opens up, uh, it actually replaces the current window. It replaces it, yeah. So if you want to keep people on your site, you want to keep people on your site, let's change that target. Open up the link again. Current window replaces. Wait, see where it says pop-ups? I wonder if that's, see the pop-ups tab? You want to try it? Yeah. Pop-up type, window pop-ups. Uh, but it doesn't let you link, or you have to... Well, it's in the link already. Oh, yeah. So here, try this one. Um, you probably don't want to show the menu bar or the toolbar. Let's, up, let's update. Yeah. Um, let's just see. Let's update and save and see what happens. I've never played with that before. There 
There it is. That was it. Okay. So then different settings. So the make it make a reservation. So you can change the title of it. You can remove that address bar right. from it. So those are all the features that we were seeing. That is pretty cool. Yeah. So inside the JCE editor, remember you click on that link button, come to pop ups and then you can change title. You can create the dimensions for that and everything. So that's really cool. Thanks for the question.